Okay, so for this look, we went for a little bit more of a dressed up look. This is like maybe a second day, probably at nighttime. So what's really fun about this look is that it's mixing prints, but it's also mixing colors and it's mixing tones, which is I think something very difficult to pull off. So you have to get the right mixture. What works with this is that it's the same print just in two different colorways. There's the hot pink version on top and the blue on the bottom. Now, it's also a really sophisticated silhouette, so you're not showing too too much, you know, you want to leave a little bit of mystery when you're going on a kind of a second date. And then we have the beautiful emerald costume jewelry necklace that's from my Bits and Bobs collection, and it just adds like a third dimension, a third color to round this whole outfit out. Mm -hmm. The hair looks incredibly beautiful and silky and shiny, but I can't do it without using the right product. So what I opted for is from Joico Smooth Cure. It's a four-stage program. It has a shampoo, has a conditioner. My favorite is the leave-in. It's a lightweight cream that you mm. apply to freshly shampooed and conditioned hair. I need One that. pump, mm -hmm. apply it to damp hair, comb through, and your blow dry is easy, smooth, shiny, and silky. So, you know, when you put heated tools on it, every now and then is okay, but on a regular basis, it really zaps the moisture. Your blondes really dull out, reds go brown, so you want to avoid that. So protection is the key here. Okay. I love the thermal style and protecting. Mm -hmm. It's a lightweight liquid, so you know it's not gonna weigh the hair down. Mm -hmm. It's gonna keep the compact of the cuticle much flatter, so everything stays healthier in China. Okay. Gonna make this easy peasy one, two, three. Mm -hmm. What I love about this is that, you know, when you're going on um, your meeting, your dating, is that you don't overdo everything. Right. I love the simplicity of this. I think it's very pretty. The guys can get their hands through the hair. They can feel and touch how beautiful mm -hmm. that hair is. Mm -hmm. And from top to bottom, it's a real winner. Right, I think less is more is always the key, especially for a first date, because you want you to show. You want to really show who you are and not let a look overpower you. when you're meeting someone out for a casual date, you don't want to look like you're trying too hard. I feel like that could scare off somebody right away. So we went with a little bit more of a casual look. Now I didn't want to just put her in a t-shirt, so I put her in a dressed up version of a t-shirt. It still has that casual aspect to it, but it has a little bit of more detail in the sleeve and a little bit more of a sophisticated fabric. And then we have our fun party shorts. That's what I like to call these. It's a little bit of fun, colorful print in the front and then black in the back, so it's really flattering for all angles. So pretty, so stunning and eye catching. <laughs> so for the hair, I mean, amazing. I think that a lot of people, when they're kind of doing their hair and makeup, sometimes it's going to be overboard. Mm. What you want to do is project who you are, not what you think you want to be exactly. and who you're trying to be. So um, my tips are very, very easy. We've got incredible, um, very thick hair, but thick hair can be very unruly. And sometimes getting a little bit of movement in or getting a little bit of shine can be very difficult. Mm. So I reached out for the Power Whip. Mm. And this is an excellent product because it's a, it's a mousse, but it has an incredible hold but the one thing I want to say is that when people think of a firm hold they think that it's going to be drying they can't get the brush through the hair mm -hmm. with our technology you can but the incredible thing is she can go from this look today and tomorrow she can straighten her hair with the same product in that she had the day before Amazing. Yeah? yeah so the incredible thing is use your fundamentals think of your look think of what you need to build mm -hmm. and then think of what you want to finish mm -hmm. to finish what I did was to use super shine that's okay. exactly what it does. It looks super shiny. There's a huge <laughs> difference absolutely between a natural shine and a shine that looks kind of oily mm, and unattractive. Crazy. It should mm -hmm. look believable. You could start at the sides and then start working into the back area. Mm -hmm. But really what I would do is be a lot more organic about how you do this. Don't be so fidgety about, you know, taking your sections perfect. You might want to give it a light comb through with, your, you know, a large comb. Mm -hmm. Here's a large barreled iron. And then all you're going to do is simply take this and you're going to wrap it and work it in a vertical manner and you're going to break it up. Sometimes I'll leave the ends out. Mm -hmm. I'm doing it this way. If I was at home, you might want to do it this way. Okay. But what you're going to do is basically you can see that you're going to get a mixture of curves that work away from the face. And I like to leave the ends out. You can just feed it through. Mm -hmm. Repeat the process. Look, see? Mm -hmm. With every section. And then you just work across. There you go. Bingo. Less is more. Use your fingers. And there you have it. Mm -hmm. Always keep the hair away from the face. You know what it does? It just makes those eyes sparkle. It really brings out the cheekbones. Mm -hmm. And again, you can communicate with anybody and still look radiant. It's beautiful. So there you go. That kind of completes our look. Don't forget to check out at joico.com where you can purchase any of these products and receive more information about our incredible technology. Mm -hmm. And don't forget to check out also whitneyeve.com for my clothing collection and my jewelry collection. We'll see you guys next time on Drive to Fab.